This current setup makes me wish that it was Halloween all year round because this would be my permanent setup. But I have put it to good use because this video is going to be a how to make a Cookie Monster pumpkin DIY video so I hope that you'll give it a go unless you've watched this video knowing that you'll never try it out. I always do that. I'll be like going on a random DIY spree on YouTube and I'll end up on a video like how to make a bacon flavoured tree and it, I'm obviously never going to make that but they're just entertaining to watch so I hope you enjoy this video. Also if you're new to my channel please press that subscribe button so you will be updated on any future videos that I post. Let's go on to the next clip, see how this pumpkin turns out. So the first thing that I did was I went onto Google and I googled Cookie Monster and I used the images that I found on there as inspiration for my design. Also I already carved out the pumpkin and took the lid off but I just wanted to show you the part where I drew on a really big mouth with a sharpie and then cut that out and obviously that is going to be the large mouth of the Cookie Monster, make it bigger rather than smaller. I placed some foil inside the pumpkin and then spray painted it a midnight blue kind of colour. It turned out so so nicely the colour and I just left it to dry for two hours. During that period I moved on to the eyes of the Cookie Monster that are quite huge or really really big. So I used baubles for each eye and also I could have used ping pong balls but I stuck with baubles but just letting you know that there are quite a few options. From there all I had to do was cut and draw some pupils and all I did for this was use a white piece of paper to draw out two large circles, colour them in with a black sharpie and hot glue gun them onto the baubles or if you are using a ping pong ball, the ping pong ball. I would also just like to say that for the second eye, make it slightly higher and further left than the other eye because Cookie Monster is slightly bog-eyed. <laughs> now the spray paint is finally dry, we can move on to sticking and gluing on the eyeballs. So as you can see it has set a really really nice deep blue colour and I already stuck on one eye but I forgot to film that bit so just follow what I do for the second eye. Simply hot glue gun it at the bottom and stick it onto the top of the pumpkin and literally that is all you have to do for the eyes. Now is my favourite part where you have to just stuff its face full of cookies and also kind of make them kind of seep out of the mouth and spread along the floor because he's like stuffing his mouth and throwing up and regurgitating cookies in my mind so that's how I envisioned it and that's how I have done it on my cookie monster. This is the final result. I really hope you like it, I am in love with it. Have a absolutely wonderful Halloween and if you recreate this Cookie Monster pumpkin, send it to me on Instagram. That is the end of today's video guys, I really hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, leave it a big thumbs up and stay tuned for my next video. Bye guys!